In this video we will set up this CAPTCHA verification system using Sapphire Bot. Let's see how this CAPTCHA system actually works. This is an embed message with a button attached to it. When this button is clicked then it shows this CAPTCHA image with select menu of four options and a skip button. When the skip button is clicked it edits the message and shows a new CAPTCHA image with select menu of four options and a back button. If we select a wrong answer then it shows a verification failed message and it will send a failed log on a private channel. If we select the correct answer then it edits the message and shows a verification success message and it will send a success log on a private channel. Many heartfelt thanks to Alexandri for conceiving this brilliant CAPTCHA verification system idea and generously providing all the Sapphire raw codes, as well as designing the captivating CAPTCHA images. Today's video is brought to you by Zap, the all-in-one creator toolkit. As the head of product at Zap, I'm thrilled to have their support for this channel with just over 250 subscribers. You can create websites like this for free using Zap. Zap has page blocks which helps you to easily add new elements to the page like a contact form, YouTube feed and much more. You can sell products and send email newsletters on Zap. Zap has advanced analytics which helps you to understand from where your page visitors are coming from, which device they were using and lot more metrics. With Zap's new feature posts, you can start your own blogs like these. Visit the Zap link in the description to get started on Zap for free. Thank you Zap for the tremendous help as our amazing sponsor. Now let's dive into our video. Let's set up the server first. Go to the role settings and clear all permission for at everyone role. Then create a new role called verified. Make sure Sapphire role is above this verified role. Create a category for the logs channel, this channel only visible to your server staff team. Now create a new channel called Verification. This channel is only visible for people who are not past the verification. Let's set up Sapphire now, go to the dashboard and here I don't have any message templates and components as this is a new server. Link to this website is in the description. Create message template using these Sapphire raw codes.
For verification failed message we have to create three templates because we have total of four options and three of them were fails and Sapphire won't allow you use one template for three options. These components will be automatically created as we have used the raw code for the templates.
Here option 2 is the correct answer so we have to configure option 2 as success. Here option 1 is the correct answer so we have to configure option 1 as success.